now that we have all the files and their file paths available to us in a variable we have to pass all this word files into this sequence okay to do that we have to be able to iterate to this array for that we have for each activity for each activity is used is similar to whatever we have right over for each row for each row is for data table and for each activity is to iterate along any array list or anything of that type here we have to change this object to string because the values available to us are strings in this particular array then in this for each we have to place this sequence because this has to be happening every time just just cut it and paste it okay here is the sequence so here also for every word file that we have it will go it will click on select file and it will enter the path while entering the path this is hard coded but we have to replace this with item item is nothing but the value that we have over here to this we have to pass the array of strings variable that we have next it will click on open it will type the path it will click on convert button and it will wait for that completed status and it will display done right here okay when we enter something when we are entering something if we want to clear that field for the next time we have to check this to true okay if it's fault it will leave the data available in that particular field and it will continue but if we want to clear that field we can click on clear okay just save this this is done for us okay this is this was something that we have put down to display some values to the user these are of no use to us right now you can just remove this okay and you can just leave the ones that are needed this is something which is needed this is something which is needed and this was the final one let's have a quick run of and see what happens okay this time the expected result is that we have to have the PDF files for all the word files that we have with us right so let me run it once the process has just started because this time we are unable to see the input file as because we have removed the those two particular activities that we have used earlier so it has directly skipped to creating the word files this time it is creating the PDF files first it's David it has clicked on convert completed okay done see this time it's dynamic it is taking the second document and this is something that I have told you earlier to clear the field if I'm not clearing this particular type into field it will start entering the data one after the other which will lead to a lot of exceptions that we might encounter so this time it is taking the third document and is clearing the field and then entering the directory field done and the final sumanth document this is also converted and this is the end of the process we can see it has created the word PDF files for each and every word file available this is for David this is for Sharath and this is for Sumanth so this is how we have created a dynamic code to create the PDF files for each and every word files available and create each and every word files from this particular master template that was about sales report generation process